Good morning, Snippets. So today is the day that I moved back to Baylor. Today is the day that I moved back from my junior year, and it's gonna be great, it's gonna be awesome, I'm so excited, ah. I wanna show you guys somebody that found me last night after I was about to go to bed. Ta-da! Look, we haven't seen them in a while. Hello. Hi guys. You miss me? Did you miss me? Oh, did you miss the camera? Did you miss me? What? Me? Me? <laughs> They, so, they found me last night, whenever I was about to go to bed, they were like, hey, we want in. I was like, okay. Oh, I also want to show you guys what I'm going to have to endure today. I'm hoping that this doesn't last, but I'm going to show you guys what, no, stay back, stay back. I'm going to show you what it's like right now outside. It's like absolutely pouring, and it's like, the thunder is so loud, it's like shaking the building, and it woke me up. Ooh. It's like, oh, it's terrifying. I checked the weather, and it's supposed to only be like this in Anna, and only for like another few hours, luckily. And I checked the forecast for Waco, and it's only like 30% uh, in the early, like in the in the morning, and then it's supposed to be gone by the afternoon. Like, can you put this in the brain? It's supposed to be gone by the afternoon when I get there, so. I'm hoping that whenever I get to Waco, this won't be an issue. <laughs> I need to start getting ready. I need to start packing a few things up because I fell asleep actually before I could do anything of importance. So there's still a couple things I need to sort through and stuff. Let's get ready to go back to school. <laughs> so I actually fell asleep last night before I could do much of like anything productive. So I just brought all the stuff inside that was on the patio and it luckily didn't get very wet because I have a roof patio and even though it was like raining super bad, uh, super bad, luckily like nothing really got messed up. So I moved that in here and then I also looked through some clothes because my mom's been like begging me to like look through some of my old clothes and see which ones I want to be able to give away to my younger nephews. So I sorted through my clothes and now I'm finishing editing an Alamad because I haven't been able to upload while I'm here because the internet in my room at my house is really bad so I'm just gonna wait till I get back to school but I'm gonna try and like keep up with the editing so I'm finishing editing one right now. And and then I need to grab all my textbooks that I'm going to be taking back to school with me that I'm going to be selling and then I need to start getting ready and my mom and I are going to IHOP for breakfast and then I'm going to get my hair done and then I'm going back to Waco. <laughs> While I'm here editing though I've got this little doofus here with me and I've also got Shirley sleeping over there so I don't even need to say much I'm just trying to get them on camera as much as possible because they're not going to be on camera again for a really long time. <sighs> Yeah, you do that, Yawn. I just want all this raw footage of you being next to me. Because I'm not going to see you babies again for a while. Because I miss them, because I can't have them at school with me. And I just, oh man, it just breaks my heart. It breaks my heart so much. I miss my dogs. Okay, I am all ready to go. I am about to leave to go. Actually, I'm going to drive to Christian's house and drop off some choco pies because I went to do that yesterday and I forgot to. I'm going to drop off some choco pies at Christian's house and then I'm going to drive to IHOP to meet my mom for breakfast and I'm going to go get my hair cut and then be on to Waco. So this is the end of this room for now. I don't know the next time I'll be back here, but this is how I'm leaving it as I prepare to go for my junior year. Oh, I need to turn the air off. Okay, so now I'm about to leave and I guess this is goodbye to this room until I come back. I don't know the next time I'll be coming back, but I'm off for my junior year of college. Okay, so I just stopped off at Christian's house to drop her off the choco pie things. And now I'm about to leave to meet my mom and McKinney at IHOP. And I actually want to show you this. So my backpack is so heavy, my car thinks that there's a passenger there. And so it'll beep at me telling me the passenger's not buckled. So I had to buckle up the passenger seat. But my little poo is here, so it's kind of like I do have like a little passenger's trapped in. I need to go to IHOP now because I'm so late. All right, just got to IHOP. It's, it's still raining and I like I really hope that this it's not supposed to be raining in Waco by the time I get there, so I'm really hoping this dies down, but this is just really inconvenient. But anyway, I'm gonna go have a nice like brunch with my mom, and then I'm gonna text my hair lady and see if I can go to her house to get my hair done. Like she said to text me to make sure that I could come. So I'm gonna text her to make sure, and then I'm gonna be to Waco. All right, so I just got done at IHOP. IHOP is behind me. I had a nice brunch-ish with my mom. I had a chicken Parmesan, which is apparently new at IHOP, but it was really good. Like the Parmesan was very good. And the chicken was really well done and the pasta was really good so oh it was good now I'm on my way to get my hair done I texted Sue my hair lady she said she can do my hair so I'm gonna, I'm gonna get my hair cut really fast and then I gotta get on the road it's already 11 15 and I haven't even gotten there yet so I need to hurry up and get out of here but oh I'm just excited to be back at school uh oh guys 
I'm at my hair lady's castle again. You know what this means? It means I just got my hair cut. I, I think it looks really good. It's very different, so just be wary. I'm looking at myself in the rear view mirror right now, and it looks okay. I saw that little hair is all over me, but it's okay. If it bothers me enough, I'll take a shower as soon as I get to Waco, but I think it'll be fine. Oh, I'm nervous to show you, but it looks good. Okay, anyway, three, two, one. Ta-da! <laughs> so this is my new hair for the fall. I mean, I'm probably gonna style it a little bit. I'm not gonna worry about it now because I'm gonna be driving and I don't care. I'm gonna be moving stuff today, so it's gonna get gross anyway. But starting tomorrow, I think I'll probably style it a little bit, but this is the length of it. <laughs> I think it looks really good. I really like it, and I think that it'll be good for me, like, going into the fall because I probably won't be back for at least, like, two months or so. So I changed shirts because my other one was super hairy and gross, and I even got this one kind of hairy, but it's not bad enough where I'm gonna hate myself because like if I were to wear, be wearing that other shirt the little hairs would be on my neck and like bothering me so much on the way down there I just want to die I'm gonna stop by quick trip really fast and get a drink and then go to the bathroom and then I'm gonna start my road trip down there it's just after noon so hopefully I'll get there by ooh, 3 3 30 that's my hope <laughs> okay guys well I just stopped a quick trip I'm here right now I stopped to go to the bathroom really fast I got myself a drink and I've got k-pet pandora k-pop k-pop pandora ready and I've got my GPS open now I'm ready to go to Waco. I'm so, I'm nervous and I'm excited for one, for the car ride and two, just for this year in general. Like I just, I feel such good things for this year, especially cause like with all that happened last year, like I'm just ready to like, I guess kind of make up for that or like, not necessarily make up, but like move, like take what I learned last year and like, help it propel me forward just like in life and in school and everything and all sorts of things and things and stuff okay so I'm about to take the car right there I'm probably just gonna go straight there I just checked my GPS it said it should take me just about two hours to get there so I should get there about 2 30 it's 12 32 right now so I should get there about 2 30 but I drive a little bit slow sometimes so at least by three I should get there so I guess I'll see you when I get to Waco okay everyone so I made it to Waco ah! I'm back for the fall, man, 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 man. So it's actually raining in Waco right now. It's not supposed to be, so I'm gonna check and see like when it's supposed to stop because I don't want to move stuff in the rain, especially because like I have until the end of the evening. I like I want to try and get as much done as, done as possible, but I can go wait at my apartment if I need to. So I'm gonna go. I have yet to check in at Penland. I need to go check in at Penland with CLNL. And then I need to go check into my room at Brooks. And then I don't know. I might go to my apartment. I was gonna unload the stuff that I have in the car to my room first, but I really don't want to do that while it's raining. So I might just go to my apartment after I do all my check-ins and stuff and then unload my first load and then go back to my apartment and load up my car again. Or maybe, I, just, I don't know, that sounds kind of stupid. I'll figure it out, but I need to go check in right now. <laughs> I'm just glad that I made it, yay! Wow, welcome back to Baylor, I guess. Look at this, it's absolutely insane. Oh my gosh, I've never seen that, ever. What the heck, it wasn't supposed to be raining at all. What the poop, this is dumb. Okay, so I just made it to the room. They put the beds in the wrong spot. They put my bed here and they put this bed there when my bed is supposed to be there. See, like I told you I got like the super bed loft thingy thing. Yeah, that's what it looks like. So this is the room, empty. <laughs> and I'm, I, like I said, I'm gonna wait till the rain stops. That sounds like it might be lighting up. That might just be my imagination, my hopeful imagination. <laughs> but I don't know. I'm gonna wait till it stops to move anything. But I'm gonna like set up the room the right way, put all the furniture in the right place, and do 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 do, and then move stuff in. <laughs> okay, I think I have the room set up how I'm gonna want it. So I've got the Brian's bed here. I'm trying to leave the window open. And then I've got Brian's desk and uh, thingy here. I'm gonna buy a thing to put food in and hopefully we can get a fridge. I told you about the whole fridge thing. I don't know. Hopefully we can get a fridge. Those things will go here. And here is my bed set up. Ba -ba -ba -ba. So this is what it looks like all set up and I might, I haven't decided, but I might film vlogs like from here. I'll just turn the chair around and I might like film them there. I haven't decided, but I, that might be what I do. I was gonna use this wall, but there's like these outlets here and plus like the fridge and the food thing needs to go somewhere, so it would probably go here. So, I don't know, we're still figuring out, but it's really hot in my room, and the rain is starting to stop, so I might go to my apartment and pick up my stuff and try and move in. It feels so nice to have my card swipe work again. For the longest time, I would try and swipe into there and the JCR, and it wouldn't let me in. Now it does. So I'm gonna move my car around and bring in the stuff that I have in my car right now, because the rain's kind of letting up for now. I'm hoping it'll just go away, but and then I'm gonna load up my stuff for the apartment and try and bring it here. Okay, so I got my entire car load unloaded, and now I'm gonna head to my apartment, pack up my car, because the rain has stopped, at least for a little while. It's supposed, they said it's supposed to stop for like two hours, so hopefully I can get my whole room done in two hours. I got my dolly here with me. I'm about to drive to the apartment, load up the car, 
and I just need to get myself finished moved in. It's 4.10ish right now, so hopefully I can get done soon-ish. <laughs> All right, bruhs. So I got my car loaded up. I got this stuff here, and then I got a whole bunch of stuff in the back. I cannot see behind me. That's great. And then I got stuff in the trunk. Luckily, Emily is here. Emily and her boyfriend are here, and they helped me load the car, which was so nice of them. I'm gonna have to unload it by myself, but I, it's so much easier to unload than to load. So, well, actually, maybe not. I don't know, but I'm so grateful for their help. Like, they got here a little bit earlier, and they're like, please let us help. So I was like, okay. <laughs> so I'm about to take this stuff back. Uh, I got most of it in this little trip, but I didn't get all of it, so I'm gonna grab the rest of the stuff when I come back. There's not much left. I got pretty much everything here. So I'm gonna take this stuff, come back for the rest of the stuff, and then I might have to take a special trip for my bike, and then my hanger clothes. But this is most of the stuff, so this is good. <laughs> okay, so it took me a while, but I just finished unloading my first load of stuff. I went to head back to the apartment and grab some more stuff. I don't know if Emily's still there. Emily, hopefully Emily and her boyfriend are still there, because they can help me load more stuff. But I don't have that much more at the apartment, actually, but I will have to make a special third trip, probably for my bike, because I'm gonna have to put the seats down and hope that my bike will fit back there. And if not, I don't know how I'm gonna get it here. But I'm gonna go back to the apartment, load some more stuff. And then I think after I finish, there's a mosquito in here. After I finish unloading stuff, I think Grant and I are gonna go eat somewhere. And it took me a while to unload because I was loading all the stuff up by myself. And I like it's hard to do a dolly by yourself. And my dolly has flat wheels and I tried to pump them up and it wasn't working. And things are crazy, but I'm just glad to be back at Baylor. Baylor's great. Hello, Baylor. I'm so glad to be, well, I mean, I've been here but I'm glad to be back on campus. I gotta get more stuff. <laughs> okay, I don't know how blurry the screen is because it's really humid outside, but I just finished unloading everything. Emily and her boyfriend actually brought their truck and brought my bike over, so that was really nice of them. I think it's fogging up again, dang it. So I now have everything upstairs. None of it's unpacked, like it's all in a mess, but I have it all upstairs now. I'm bringing my dolly up because it takes up like a poop ton of room in my car because the car is really small. So I'm gonna keep it in my room probably until Sunday when I drive to Arlington because I need the space in my car and in case I use my car for welcome week. Plus, I think Grant and I are about to go to dinner, maybe, if he still wants to go. So I need to, woo, I need to keep that room clear in the car. So I'm gonna bring this upstairs, find a place for it just for a week, uh, I don't know. So anyway, I'm gonna head upstairs, find out if Grant wants to eat, and then if he does, I'm gonna shower, change, and then get ready to go. It's so humid outside. But I'm just ready to be back and I'm glad I'm here and there's a spider web on my face. I'm just glad to be back and Okay, yeah, it's gross. It's so humid, but I'm just glad to be back. Okay, I'm back in the room. This is uh, my room for 2014, 2015. Of course, like completely not put together whatsoever, but eventually this will become a room. And I also, I don't know if I'm gonna end up using this door mirror or not because whenever it's on the door, it doesn't close right. And so I'm like, do I care enough about having a door mirror to have a door that closes like poop? So I don't know, I may, so I did not keep it on there. I don't know. It's not that bad. I guess you just have to get used to it. I don't know. I, I'm being dumb anyway. I need a shower and figure out what the rest of the plans are because I am so tired. I'm just glad to have everything up here now. Okay, so we've made a decision. We're going to Whataburger, I think. So I need, I don't have time to shower or anything, but I might change my shirt and then like at least like try and de-smell a little bit. And then Grant and Zeb and Jeanette and I are going to Whataburger and then I'm going to Walmart afterwards because I have a lot of stuff that I need to get. But uh, so much is happening. I'm just glad to be back, yay. Okay, I just finished putting everything upstairs and changed my clothes. Now I'm on my way to go pick up Jeanette. Yee, yee, yee. Me and Jeanette and Grant and Zeb are going to Whataburger. Then, I'm, then they're gonna drive Jeanette home and I'm gonna go to Walmart and I gotta get a bunch of stuff. And I'm glad I'm going alone because I take forever at the store and I always feel bad because I hate making other people wait on me. So anyway, that's where we're going now. Oh, P.S. The rain is starting to pick back up, so I'm glad I finished when I did because it's like, it's just now starting to pick up, so I finished like just the right time. <laughs> okay, so Grant, Zeb, Jeanette, and I just had a dinner at Whataburger. Actually, in the car next to me, they're right there. I wonder if they can see me vlogging. Can they see me? I don't know. <laughs> There's Grant. Okay, so I'm about to go to Walmart and get a bunch of stuff that I need, and I'm not taking anyone with me because I, I take forever in the store, so I'm gonna head to the store and try and not spend all of my money. And then I need to go back to my room and try and like set something up because Brian's gonna be there tomorrow and I don't want my stuff in his way. <gasps> I've been in Walmart forever and I'm spending so much money and I hate it, but I have to, there's so much stuff I have to get and I just, ugh, God, it's, it's so annoying, but I'm almost done and then I'm going to head, I forgot, I remember that I forgot <laughs> that, and that sounds dumb, I remember that I forgot my hanger clothes at the apartment, so I gotta go pick those up after this and then take all this stuff upstairs and I haven't even gotten to setting anything up yet and it's already super late. I'm tired, it's a good, I'm glad to be back. I'm just really tired. <laughs> okay, I just got back to the room. I dropped off most of my stuff. I still have to go back downstairs and grab two more of my big boxes. 
And then I texted Zach and Emily, and the apartment was locked. I went to the apartment actually to see if anybody was there. No one was there. No one was answering the phone, so the door was locked and the key wasn't there. I got back to Brooks, and Zach texted me saying he'll be home in like 15 minutes. So I'm gonna go back to the outpost and grab my hanging clothes, and then come back here, and then try and get to something. It's already super late. I don't know how late I'm gonna be up tonight, because I have to get a lot of this out of the way, because Brian's gonna be here tomorrow. So I'm in a poop mood at the moment because I just spent a lot of money, and I hate spending money, and I hate not having money because I feel like insecure. Like if feel like unsafe and like just like I don't know I feel weird and so I don't have money and I'm tired and I haven't set anything up where did the day go I just but I, I, I uh, all, all those things aside though things are great and I'm just glad to be home again <laughs> well it's been a long day of moving stuff but I finally got everything in the room I got in the apartment finally Emily I finally got a hold of Emily and got all my clothes out of the apartment loaded them in the car and I just brought them all upstairs I haven't even like sorted them I haven't even sorted them yet I just kind of like I was so tired I just threw them all over the place so I need to sort through them still now now that it's super late I think it's like midnight now now I can start to getting to like putting stuff away let's see how fast I can do this like I have to go through at least some of it because Brian's coming tomorrow so like I need to like leave space for him for when he gets here so let's see how much of this I can get done in the next little bit <laughs> okay guys I have done as much as I can possibly stand tonight I need to go to sleep oh I'm so tired I'll show you guys more of what my room looks like in the morning but it I got as much as I could possibly get done before I spontaneously combust from exhaustion. <laughs> so yes, it's been a very eventful first day back. Uh, I didn't get as much done as I wanted to, but then again, when do I ever? I think tomorrow will be good. I start my first day welcoming training tomorrow, and then also my roommate moves in tomorrow, so that'll be an interesting adventure. So I just need to let tomorrow come now, so I will see you guys tomorrow for at least another minute. Good night! Christian, I made it to H Mart. Christian, we're in H Mart. Yeah, they've got so many cool drinks. I got three different flavors of ramen, which I'll show you guys later. Because I don't have much memory, but oh.